Welcome to the Heroes and Heritage Leadership and Educational Summit. My name is Admiral Paul Zeekamp. I am the Commandant of the United States Coast Guard. As Commandant, I am responsible for the 88,000 women and men who serve in America's Coast Guard. We are a member of the armed services and we are deployed around the world, combating the flow of illegal drugs and human trafficking, while protecting those on the sea and securing our maritime borders. Today, as I film this video, we have Coast Guard personnel stationed in Saudi Arabia, patrol boats serving in the Persian Gulf alongside our nation's defense forces, and women and men in Africa working with partner nations. And one of our icebreakers just returned from a successful deployment to Antarctica. And of course, some of our primary missions here at home are search and rescue and protecting our maritime environment from oil spills and also protecting against illegal fisheries. Coast Guard operations today are intelligence based. They're high tech. They're fast moving. Now, I'm looking to build a 21st century workforce that draws upon the broad range of skills, talents and backgrounds found in the richness of all Americans. A diverse, specialized and adaptive workforce is an operational imperative. It is a requirement for our mission. Given the complexity of our missions and the uncertainty of our operating environment, we need people who can react and achieve national objectives. Quite frankly, I need talent like you. Since the last three decades and counting, every occupation among our uniformed service has been open to women. And yes, we are a service that empowers our junior most people. As a matter of fact, I was a captain of a patrol boat at the ripe young age of 24. So what does it take to become a member of the Coast Guard? Well, we have the Coast Guard Academy in New London, Connecticut. Nearly 300 high school graduates enroll annually, leaving four years later with a Bachelor of Science degree and a commission as an ensign in the United States Coast Guard. Also in New London is our Officer Candidate School. This is a 17-week course in leadership, navigation, law enforcement, and military traditions for individuals that already have a college degree. Graduates from this rigorous course become officers in the Coast Guard, and they are charged with leading crews around the country the day that they are commissioned. We also offer the Coast Guard's College Student Pre-Commissioning Initiative. Now that's a mouthful, and so as we do in the military, we give it an acronym, and we call it CSPI, C-S-P-I. And this provides allowances and tuitions for prospective officers during their junior and senior years of college. It's a good deal. C-SPY has become a gold standard for bringing talented officers into the Coast Guard from historically black colleges and universities, Hispanic serving institutions, and tribal colleges and universities. I am doing all I can to expand the program as C-SPY alumni are already among the very best officers in the Coast Guard today. And finally, you can enlist in the Coast Guard and attend our boot camp at Training Center Cape May. After eight weeks and upon graduation, you'll go right to work, relying on what you've learned because we're a small service. Our women and men put their training to work each and every day and every job in the Coast Guard leads to increased responsibility, and with that increased responsibility comes increased pay. If you'd like to be on our part-time team, if you will, you can join the Coast Guard Reserve. Our Reserve Force offers paid part-time roles that come with impressive benefits as you work side-by-side -side with active duty members of our force. And it works like this. You'll typically serve two days a month and two weeks a year at a base near your home. You'll also receive training in dynamic and relevant fields, such as healthcare, aviation, law enforcement, search and rescue, in fact, the full spectrum of our Coast Guard missions. And you don't have to wear 
the uniform to join the U.S. Coast Guard either. In fact, a large number of our most important roles are staffed by civilians in locations across the country. As a civilian in the Coast Guard, you will provide essential services in diverse business and technical fields while enjoying superior training and excellent federal benefits. And as a member of the Coast Guard, whether it's active, reserve, officer, civilian, you will serve where your skills are most needed. You'll accomplish and be part of missions you never thought possible. You'll have experiences found in no other organization and you will be part of a team that is making an impact each and every day. Most importantly, you will experience personal growth and become a leader in your own right as you're instilled with what it means to serve our nation and its citizens. Men and women serving in the Coast Guard are trained to be at their best 24 hours a day, seven days a week. They know that lives depend on them doing their jobs right. Top organizations require people who are proficient, self-motivated, and adaptable to changes on our increasingly globalized world. Without question, attracting and retaining diverse talent are critical components of the Coast Guard's overall mission effectiveness. Simply put, a workforce of people with diverse races, genders, backgrounds, and perspectives embody the best tenets of our country and make us a better Coast Guard. I can tell you from my personal experience of nearly four decades of military service that I have never been more proud to wear the uniform that I wear today. Do you think you have what it takes to save lives? Bust drug traffickers? Secure the cyber domain or catch those doing harm to our environment? I hope you'll join us and be, become part of the best workforce the Coast Guard has ever assembled. A service that prides itself on being always ready. Or as our motto says, Semper Paratus. <laughs>